Life on the Red Horse Ranch. <laughs> boys at Red Horse Ranch recently received news that two outlaws of the old Dawson gang had escaped jail in Roaring River. So far as any of the boys know, Dewey Dawson, who is now living on Red Horse Ranch, is a son of Trigger Dawson, the slain leader of that gang. When we last visited the ranch, mysterious riders came up in the night and attempted to take Dewey away with them. It was a dark night, and the boys found it difficult to trail the strangers. There may be more news as we join them today. Here they are. Wyoming, far across the great divide. Skies are brighter, hearts are lighter, and the door is open wide. There's a girl in Wyoming, neath the prairie stars that shine. Let me wander way up yonder. Sweetheart of mine, through the purple sage once more we'll ride, 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 down the sunset trail together side by side, all alone in the gloaming, we will plan a nest for two, just a home. are brighter, hearts are lighter, and the door is open wide. There's a girl in Wyoming, neath the prairie stars that shine. Let me wander way up yonder to that old sweetheart of mine. Through the purple sage once more we'll ride. already, Alabama? Yeah, and just as well not rolled out for all the good it did me. I didn't think you could trail them very far. No, I lost the track soon as I got over the hill there. 
I couldn't find a trace of which way they went. Oh, you boys keeping an eye on Dewey, aren't you? Tex Owens is teaching him how to play mumble peg over around the house there. Well, I think I'll go over and talk to Dewey. I have an idea. He knows something he ain't told yet. <laughs> you teach Dewey to play mumble peg, Tex? I guess there ain't no law against taking out a little time to sing a while for him. <laughs> I'd rather hear him sing than play mumble peg, wouldn't you, Alabama? <laughs> sure I would, Dewey. You mind if I talk to the boy alone a minute, Tex? Of course not. Found out anything yet, Alabama? No, I'm afraid I haven't, Tex. We'll join you and the boys in a little bit. All right. All right, Alabama. So long, Dewey. So long, Tex. What do you want, Alabama? Well, I just thought maybe you and me might solve this little mystery together. You mean why them fellas tried to get me last night? Yeah. Are you sure you don't know who those men were that tried to take you away? No, honest I don't, Alabama. It was too dark to see them, and they just grabbed me. Mm -hmm. I guess they got scared when they heard you coming. Well, how many of them was there, Dewey? Two of them. I'm sure of that. Now, just between you and me, why do you think they tried to get you? Gosh, I don't know. I never did nothing to them or nobody. Do you suppose you knowed something they'd like to find out? Uh, something maybe your dad told you. Maybe some kind of a secret. But he never did tell me nothing. Not even where he went. Well, partner, it looks like we ain't getting nowhere here, does it? <laughs> we might as well go back and join the boys. Yeah, let's listen to the fella sing some more. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Elizabeth. <laughs> Across the meadow where the brook comes winding through With a girl out yonder down in Wonder Valley Who I vowed to love me skies forever blue I'll never forget her tears a day we part The love light in her eyes came smiling through. I'd give all I own to be in Wonder Valley, just to wonder once again, sweetheart, with you. How I long to wander down to Wonder Valley. The meadow where the brook comes winding through With a girl out yonder down in Wonder Valley Who I vow to love me skies forever blue I'll never forget her tears a day I'd give all I own to be in Wonder Valley Just to wonder once again, sweetheart, with you Well, come on and sit down, Alabama. You and Dewey. Might as well wait here for Chuck. Well, let's hear some more of that music, boys. Come on, lay down, Elizabeth. Imagine anything named Elizabeth catching a rabbit. Oh, I can't. Well, by golly, would you look who's riding up to the Red Horse Ranch? Why, oh, no. Sheriff Simkin. <laughs> Stop your horse, you old ranny hand, you. Get down out of that saddle. Howdy, boys. How do you do? Howdy, Sheriff. 
I can just bet I know what the sheriff's doing out here, too. Come on, boys, let's get our instruments. No, 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 now, 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 boys, I ain't got no time for foolishment. I'm in right smart of a hurry. Oh, come on now, Sheriff. You've got time to hear one more tune. I don't know. We know how you like these boys playing and singing. Grab a hold of your doghouse there, yeah, Idaho, on, and yeah, let's go. Yeah. Yeah. Tell there's a couple of them cattle rustlers broke jail over in Roaring River. <laughs> that, that's just what I'm here for. I'm a chase from them rustlers. Uh, uh, which way do you reckon he went? What do you want to know for? So you can run the other way? <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute there, Arizona. <laughs> Sherry, huh? you got some reason to believe them rustlers are out this way? Hey, you can just bet your sweet life I have. Why, we trailed them last night, clear across the bar D, and then lost the trail. Uh, mm. you, you ain't seen nothing of them, have you? I reckon that's just what we have, Sheriff. Now that you mention huh? it. Huh? Uh, where'd go? Which way, huh? Uh, now, 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 where are they? So uh, that's who they are. Now, going. now, now, listen, boys. If you're holding something from me, I, I'm a law, remember? I that? reckon I, law. we have got something to tell you, Sheriff. Huh? Okay. Them outlaws were here at this ranch last night. They was, huh? Why, they tried to make, uh, try to make off this boy here. Well. Uh, we didn't know who there was then, but I'm sure that's who it was. Who, who this boy? Oh, yes, uh, Trigger Dawson's boy, huh? Well, anyhow, Dewey was living with Trigger Dawson. Them rustlers was members of Dawson's old gang. That's right, Sheriff. But what would they want with Dewey here? I don't know, Alabama. But I told you it was a dangerous thing, bringing that outlaw's boy on this place. Yeah, you were right, Sheriff. We may be in for a little excitement before this thing's over. Then it was the two escaped outlaws who tried to kidnap Dewey. Don't fail to hear the next episode of Red Horse Ranch. <laughs>